Welcome back everybody to channel 2. Today we've got Risk of Rain 2 and we're going to be doing alternate game mode, uh, Simulacrum. It's actually like an endless zombie wave basically. I've got a few good runs before. I've, I've done Monsoon 27 on, on, <laughs> on Commando, 76 on Huntress, 42 on Bandit. Uh, I don't think those, I think those are the only three characters I've <laughs> one. I think I played it and I just got off. My goal today was to get to Monsoon level 50. I probably won't make it. But let's give it a go. So we've got... Uh, I don't think I have all the skills anymore because everything reset on me. So unfortunately, all I have is the primary stuff, which is probably fine. I don't think I would use the other skill anyway. But yeah, Monsoon. Default artifacts. These are cheese, so I'm not going to do that. But let's just ready up and see what happens. So not a great starting level, in my opinion. Every game has like different interact buttons, like F, E... Reload is R, but in this game, R is a special skill. So, you know, we just gotta we just gotta figure it out as we go. So we got 25 gold. We could open up a chest. That is an amazing starting item. Okay, so I'm feeling good. What I love about Bandit is that you can get crits even when you don't have no have like only default crit chance was like one percent I think. Uh, as long as you hit things in the back. Uh, the wave ended, so I'm just gonna open this. Spend half of my health to get a corrupted item and it's weeping fungus or as we would like to call wongus so as i run i heal and what's nice about my r is that if i uh finish something with my r it'll reset all of my cooldowns so i can go invisible you know hit something go invisible again go invisible again <laughs> and so on there's a lot of prisms here uh that are gonna cause problems that don't kill them and the thing is with this game, you want to make sure you're always running around. If you've never played this before, it's very, very chaotic in the normal mode as the waves get harder. But let's grab our first item here. Ooh, I think crit glasses is better here. Even though I would say both are pretty good. I'll do armor pauldron or pulsion armor, sorry. Um, just to get that base low damage. The thing about bandit is that's really good in this mode is that it's always close quarters. So you can use your swipe as I have that, like the right click is my swipe. I haven't really used it yet because I've not really been close to enemies, but it can be useful in the future. I'm getting pelted in the back. And once the wave ends, uh, basically all the enemies get notified. There's little dots on their heads, as you can see over there. Um, and uh, then you just got to find and kill them all before the wave ends. You know, I'm going to go double swipe. Getting the extra bleeds is probably going to be better in the long run. There's a few more chests here. That, oh, wow. Okay, never mind. I should have grabbed the other thing. <laughs> That's okay, though. What's going on here? Oh, that's what's going on here. I really don't want to get hit by the red ones because those ones cause uh, fire damage if you've never played. Like I said, I'm going to try and explain a lot of things for people who have never played before. But the base, the base uh, idea is don't die. Ooh, gasoline is so good though. I mean, this is just really good. Ooh. Oh boy. It's getting a little crazy. But yeah, this is a boss wave. So if I get like an item that does extra damage to bosses, this counts for all enemies. Also, you don't want to mess around with these mushrooms. Their bombs that they drop can do a lot of damage. So I'm in trouble. All right. Why are there so many wisps? Very good. Final guy. There we go. And yeah, every boss wave gives you... Uh, green items instead so we should be moving which means i'm gonna want to grab as many of these as i can uh i don't think i have time for that one i'm just gonna back off i don't want to risk it i'm just gonna follow this little jellyfish looking thing i don't not even sure what it is oh big chest good thing i didn't buy the other ones wax quail is not the greatest item but i will take it Point set flame is good as long as the enemies don't have uh, a bubble, uh, which they can get items later on. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm getting a lot of uh, backup magazines, so I can swipe a lot. I see a shop over here, multi shop. This is the shield I was talking about. I have enough money for it. Might be good to get one, which blocks damage. Oh my gosh. And point set flame, the the corrupted item that I got, that's I have times two. It, uh, on full health enemies, when you first attack them, they blow up. So it can cause a chain reaction of damage. I think I'm still going to go with 
more defense. My biggest mistake in these runs is always picking too much offense. Uh, Bandolier is really good. Perfect. There's that chain reaction. Oh my gosh. And this is the uh, the little uh, bandolier that I just picked up. So it resets all your cooldowns when you pick those up. This is a greedy play, but I'm going to do it. 20% Ex extra damage. As long as I don't go beyond that little bar. You can see in the bottom left right here, there's a little like array bar. If I go below that, then my watches blow up. So Just, just dealing with enemies. We do a lot of damage right now, which is not always going to be the case. Three enemies left. One. Two and three. Let me get my item. Honestly, we've been picking up. Oh, <laughs> this is tougher times is really good. It's extra defense. I mm, the best defense is a good offense, I guess. Okay, now I'll get the syringe for the attack speed. I would love more crit though. All right, stay away from me. These things are horrible. You don't mess with uh, gubs or glubs, whatever they're called. So my, my invisibility also uh, creates um, a stun for anything within the certain vicinity. I think it's like a little pu a little cloud of smoke that shows you the range. Gotta be careful of these freezing uh, spheres as well because they can cause mayhem for you, possible death. All right, one enemy left. Just a little mushroom dude over here. Boom. Uh, slight crit chance. Uh, and critical strikes increased attack speed, which basically for bandit is uh, reload speed. You have the little four dots below your cursor there. Um, those four dots represent your bullets. And the more attack speed you have, the faster those regenerate. And there's a bit of a delay after you shoot. So you're better to shoot all four and then let it come back. But you can see the attack speed is pretty good. I am critting quite often. Ooh, we did get a, a round of command. So we can grab whatever we want. And I think I'm going to grab more crits because we have synergies with crits. Plus crits are just really good damage. Obviously, the bandit can guarantee crit if you're behind things, but it's not always going to happen. So I'd rather just ensure that we have a higher chance to crit. Okay, so the monster items, they do have a... <laughs> they have a backup magazine. I'm not sure if that works for them. So we got kind of lucky with that draw. Mocha is good running and uh, attack speeds. Okay, so if I have four more debuffs, that's not too bad for Bandit, but we need like bleeds and slows and stuff. Yeah, the damage is crazy. Now, when these healing enemies die, they actually heal you too, so it's good to use them right here. If you're low, you can jump in the circle. But you can also break the orb, like like that one just died from a missile. Grab this guy here. Bustling, oh, that's not bustling, this is Cautious Slug. Cautious Slug's pretty good. Gives you uh, passive healing. This is what the War Banner does. It drops like a little uh, sphere on level up. But later on when you don't level up much, it's pretty much a useless item. Stunned the jellyfish real quick. Uh-oh. I think I went invisible during the freeze, so nothing could see me. But later on, that would kill me. Almost guaranteed. Okay, another bustling fungus. We could have grabbed gasoline. Gasoline might have been the play. Oh, boy. Okay, that's immediately like I'm running up here. <laughs> Uh-oh. That's unlucky. So, my invisibility cancels my, my upward momentum if I go... If I jump out of invisibility. And what I could do is send my Q over here. That could be an interesting play. All right, so the boss is dead. Also, that will kill you instantly, that black hole. Oh, my teleporter went away. Oh, hello. He tried. What is he do? What is he doing? That's a black hole. Get out of there. Nice. Okay, so this is going to be a corrupted item. Um, and probably another Wongus. Let me grab this. Let me grab these two. All right here. See, I'm doing increasingly more damage though. I gotta run. Don't take my watch. Oh my god, my watch almost went. Okay, deals bonus damage to close enemies. There's a little red circle you can see. That is the close. That's how close the enemies have to be. It's kind of faint, but it is there. 
Wave 16. Oh my. A lot of jellyfish. They're not that bad individually. But when there's a lot of them and they freeze you, uh, it can be bad. <laughs> I can't remember if Leptin Daisy even works in this. It might. It might be interesting to, to have on hand. I'm going to grab it. I don't know if this, if this is considered a teleporter event. We'll have to find out. Oh, it worked. Okay, that's kind of busted then. I want to deal with this big wisp as, as soon as possible. I think they're called ancient wisps. I can't remember. Oh, it died. <laughs> Just this guy over here. He's standing. You good, dude? I'm getting plus 17 health every, every time I'm running now. Oh, the chain reaction's beautiful. These golems always confuse me. I always think they're fire golems. But those guys are healing golems, as you can see. They look very red, though. The only thing that gives them away is the antlers. I'm going to grab a tougher times. I think it's like 30% chance to avoid damage on the first tougher times. Then it's, it, it's um, less and less effective as you get more. Try to utilize my... My right click more, my my stabby stab in the back. I'm on a stealth mission today. Oh, that chain reaction was so good. And we're done. This is going surprisingly well. I don't know if this activates before the watch. But a chance to stun enemies would probably be good in this scenario. Oh, uh, that's a scavenger. That's scary. Try to get behind him so I can do some crits. Oh, man. I don't want to go near him, actually. This is scary. Oh, they have tougher times now. That's really bad. So now they have a chance to reduce damage. Or negate damage. So I don't, is he healing? What, did he fall? Well, he picked up a resonance disc. Oh, boy. Let's just stay behind this wall. Take my sweet time with this guy. He's picking something up again. He's scavenging something. Luckily, he's in a really bad spot. And that burn should probably finish him off. Yeah, there we go. Now, what's good about scavengers is they drop a scavenge bag. And they drop a lot of items. Now I'm just going to soak those up real quick. Grab this guy as well. Probably the best enemy we could have run into. I think there's a few more items like inside here that they didn't properly spawn. I think we just move on. There's a chest over here. Good thing I checked. Another crit glasses. Super, super important. Anything else that I can see? There is a shrine, like a corrupted shrine over there. It's a bit of a risk. Uh, I don't trust it. I'm grabbing this. Uh, I didn't want to lose my watches, so I backed off. I, I didn't I regretted the decision I just I just backed off these are the worst enemies in the game so glad that's happening greater wisp okay so the little ones are ancient wisps the big ones greater wisp it's becoming very dangerous I'm gonna keep doing my stealth as long as I have it up of course I should probably stand in my uh, war banner as much as I can. Oh boy, I missed. <laughs> ah. This guy's just burning over here. Uh, poor guy. Extra movement speed or Berserker's Pauldrons. I'm killing a lot of enemies in a big group, so probably Berserker's Pauldrons. If you kill f uh, four enemies in a quick row, you just go crazy with attack speed and movement. And I don't know if damage is increased. These rats are always annoying to blind pests and blind I can't remember the other name uh those are all buffalo oh they're called they're bison same thing to be honest with you you good over there bro and we also I hate all the blocking they're doing what are these called blind vermin so blind pests are the flying ones blind vermin are the floor ones more crits Love to see it. <laughs> I'm 
try and stun all these golems here. Alright, so they're done spawning. I'm trying to run until I can get my invisibility back up. Ugh, shoot them. Get rid of those stupid flying things. I hate those things. What? <laughs> Why is he flying? Alright, that guy's just burning alive over there, so... They'll probably just die. Where's the other guy? Is it both of them? It was both of them. The multi shops being open is good. So you can use all three. So probably a good purchase or good grab. I'm glad I grabbed Carol's band. It's been very helpful. The burn has been great. It's just a great item. It's really kind of broken. Oh boy. I'm just gonna wait over here. Yeah, the chains are not fun to deal with. There's the burn. That was all Kiro banned. Okay, the bosses are dead. So this is the halfway point. It's already getting pretty insane. It just takes one wrong move to die. Oh boy. I think Tougher Times just saved me a bit there. Ooh, Aegis is pretty good. Extra healing over top of the shields. I don't think that works. It does work for running. Receive an instant heal at low health. I think that, that will still break the watches. Our health is red because we got infusion, which is just one extra health after each kill. I think we're only 100 HP though. Oh! <gasps> Oh, extra life. Let's go. That's huge. It's what the heck? It's right on it. Huh? Oh, no. This is a really bad mutator to have. Everything everything that dies drops a little explosive. Uh, yeah, those. Oh, boy. I'm just going to I'm just going to be over here. Uh, okay. This is really good. Oh, but this is just good damage overall. All right, we just gotta stay out. We just gotta stay above that bar. If we don't, we're gonna we're gonna lose so much of our damage. That's a fire one. Things are getting tankier. If I can recycle the extra life to get like mega heals, I think I would like be in unstoppable. But I might lose the Aegis. Ooh, bleeds, finally. I'm getting stuck on things. What the heck just happened to me? There we go. Uh, this is not the greatest situation to be in. Yeah, all the flying things are dead, I think. We are luckily very fast, so the uh, golems can't track us. I think one of the things just fell. He just fell. Another opal or more stuns. I think more stuns, honestly. Like, stunning flying enemies and stunning any enemies, really, from being able to do their crazy attacks is going to be huge. It's absolute chaos. So I'm getting five swipes back just from... Just from getting my reset. Like, if I attack this thing, I get all five swipes back. Ooh. Are enemies turning into wisps? Did I read that right? They are. Why? Where's the last guy? Oh, it's just a wisp. <laughs> hmm. I guess extra base health wouldn't be bad. Oh, no. Uh, I don't know what's happening. Oh. I gotta deal with the flying enemies up there. This is really bad. Oh, boy. That was like 10 lasers facing me. I don't know even what just happened. <laughs> why did I just run into the... Why did I just run into them like that? 
That could have gone very poorly. Ooh. This is a hard choice, actually. The left and Daisy heals me for a big shield. But extra damage on Void Scent, void scent might be better. They have Wax Quail now. Does that even work for them? Okay, the eyeballs need to chill. Okay, the Void Scent damage is really good. It drops all the enemies pretty low, and then I can just finish them off with my, my ultimate. And get resets on my invisibility. What does... The boulder just hit me. That was scary. I forgot about those boulders. Gup. Is it Gup, Gip, and something? Geep. Geep is the number two, and then Gip is the last one. Oh. <laughs> I mean, we got to do it at this point. We're like, we're too far gone. Extra chest here. Gore's Tome is perfect. So chance for enemies to drop gold coins like this. Gold nuggets. Bro, stop it. There's so many gups. I'm going to hit by the boulders again or the uh, asteroid. I couldn't have asked for a better setup of items though. I mean, I definitely could, but like... It's pretty, pretty dang good. He just ran, he ran to his own demise there. <laughs> he ran to the fire. Uh, extra attack speed. Ooh, but this is pretty good now. Like, extra damage on... I think the crowbar affects like void scent damage too when it like crits when it hits the other enemies. So yeah, things are like blowing up now. Okay, yeah, I should have got got more crowbars. I think I just want to do this. Extra bleeds are super good. Yeah, look at that. Look at the chain reaction. Boss wave? Um, I think things are going well. Okay, hey, one's dead. Holy crap. Okay, I'm up here now. He's coming up. Uh, so are they. They're trying to fly up here. This became an aerial battle all of a sudden. I'm going down. Oh, there's still a lot of stuff down here. We can go back up. Try to kill the boss. Okay, he's still got his attack off, but should be okay. Not a whole lot of talking for me at this at this point in time, but I'm just trying to focus on not dying. Okay, we survived. Oh, I could get the ice band too. I don't really need equipment, so I'm not even gonna open those. I really do like the credit card. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We're kind of busted now. That's one of the best red items in my opinion. At least for a simulacrum. Oh, this is doing a lot of damage. We heal back up. There we go. Okay, I can start it, I think. Grab this. I actually avoided the damage. I'm going to wait till this round ends to grab that item. As you can see now, I'm just a running Tesla coil. So I can just run around and shock everything. Happens every 10 seconds. While you have shield, fire, fire missiles on every hit. More crits. I'm frozen. Oh boy. Uh, I'm just shocking everything. I'm just going to stand under here. It's just going for everything. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Alright, I might as well grab that. It's not a big deal. That that key is basically like a random cash spawns. That will give me a corrupted item. Definitely gasoline. Finally got gasoline. I mean, I had some options. I had some times where I could grab it, but decided against it. Oh my gosh, it's a massacre. <laughs> Can you see now why Tesla Coil might be the best item in the game? I don't know, man. It's just like, for damage, it's it's up there. Alright, uh, just just like healing monster orbs on the ground is pretty good. I'm just going to run around and let the Tesla Coil do its thing. The uh, tone of the run definitely changed the second I picked that item up. The Aegis is allowing us to keep our shield generating as we run. As you can see, the yellow shield just running around just... Keeping my shield going. 
Oh my god. Uh, my frames. Uh, what boss? Oh my god. All those mushrooms were having a party down there. I mean, I, I can be a fun guy too. I'm sorry for that one. Alright. Uh, definitely just healing on crits. I'm running away from the gold orb. There's a gold orb chasing me. I'm too fast for the gold. Can't catch me. Can't catch me. If I wait till the uh, round is about to end. Like that, I should be able to keep some of it. I'm not sure if that it works. Yeah, I kept some of the money. Let's go. One dollar off. I'm literally one dollar off of getting the chest. I'm no longer one dollar off of getting the chest. I'm slow, I'm slow, I'm slow. This is really bad. Oh, I'm invisible. Okay, this is still not like a safe run, a safe bet. Especially with the tar guys, they can really slow you down. Those minigun guys are probably my least favorite enemy in the game, so it doesn't surprise me that they're already causing me trouble. Oh man, this is a tough choice. This is a weird spot for a fight, by the way. I will say, this is the most awkward positioning for a portal to start at. Oh boy. This thing kind of bait the enemies over there and then just wait on this side. Come on, dummies. Oh, another mocha. I'll take that. So I think what's done really well for me in this round is focusing a little more on heals. I don't even know what I'm shooting at. I'm just I'm just looking at health bars. They're shooting tar, man. I hate I hate those things. I don't understand where I'm supposed to fight. Maybe I go up here. A decent little survival area, maybe. Okay, things are spawning up here. I'm gonna go in now with my Tesla coil going off. I gotta really make sure that we deal with this thing fast. There we go. Okay. Boss wave. Another goat hoof. gotta hide. Ooh. I was hoping to deal with all of them before they all did their explosive thing, but here we are. No fear. Incredible run. I think I just pa I have passed my previous record on this character, so. Okay, those? No thank you, I'm out. Is he finding a way up here? They are trying to get up here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh. A little scary. There was a spot I could hang out down there, though. Okay, he died in the void. Happiest mask could be really good. Um, it causes ghosts to spawn of enemies. So it just basically just adds little minions for you. I got the prey on. Prey on accumulator. I'm kitted out, man. Look at me. Final five waves. Another stun grenade. Another blade. Dagger. Th oh, that's actually really bad. Oh, no. I shouldn't have picked that up. I hate that thing. Whenever you get a kill, it makes you give a little burst of speed. But it's so, it's so hard to keep track of when you have a burst of speed or not. Well, nothing I can do about it now. I have it. They're called apothecary because it's like a pot to carry. Get it? Haha. -ha. We got one. <laughs> we have him as a friend. There he is. He's invisible. He's like a ghost. They're also distracted on him, which is really good. Should be dead. Dude, our, our little uh, clay guy is really helpful. That's a tenta bobble, I think. Yeah, root enemies on hit. Perfect. You 
should be dead. I'm going in. I don't care. No fear. I've got three, uh, three more <laughs> helpers. They're all distracted on the ghost. This is like one of the best items we could have gotten. Honestly, I feel like I could go to wave 100 with this, but I'm not going to do it. But still. we got three more waves to go. The rooting is really good too. Look at how much they're getting stuck. When I get the Tesla coil, I can get a lot of shield back. But if I don't have a shield, it's kind of sketch. All right, two enemies remaining. One left. Where is he? There he is. All of my ghost friends are dead. <laughs> a sixth delicate watch. I guess it has to be done. Going through. Coming through. Don't mind me. I haven't even noticed that there were blind pests on this level. I don't. I, that's the first time I've seen one. We actually got a blind pest as well. A blazing one. The final stage and a stun grenade for extra good measure. Here it is. My frames. Oh my gosh. I'm going to wait here. Oh, that came around the corner. Got to be careful. They're doing the suck. Those guys basically fall to the ground and they try to absorb health from everything around it. We still got to be careful here, man. My frames are so dead. Oh my god. I got to go in. The Tesla coil is activating. Go, go, go. Oh, hide, 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 hide. I don't even know what's happening. Am I? Oh my god, I thought I was about to die. You know what? Let's use it. Throw it in there. Is that it? Did we do it? Oh my goodness, we did it. 50 waves. Pretty stressful end, but hope you guys enjoyed. I don't know why I'm grabbing items. That's going to be it. Wow. I could definitely keep going, but I guess I'll just go to the next stage and die. Let's see how long it takes. Do your worst. Oh God. I'm still killing things. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> That's going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed. There's a lot of fun. Uh, definitely love this game. Wait, I'm back. Oh yeah, I had a revive. <laughs> what is happening to my body? Oh no. Oh, it actually counts as wave 51. Interesting. Well, either way. Dang, that was fun. That was a good one. See ya. You can't catch me.